Hutch, let's look at a movie. I'm Not There might be one of the most difficult films you will see all year. On the other hand, it might not. This film by Todd Haynes says right at the beginning that it's inspired by the music and many lives of Bob Dylan. How many? Well, at least six, because different actors play six, if not seven, personas of Dylan. Kate Blanchett, Ben Whishaw, Christian Bale, Richard Gere, Marcus Carl Franklin, and Heath Ledger. Blanchett, of course, is a woman. Franklin is a young black actor, and Bale plays two of Dylan's many personas. Haynes himself may have given the best explanation of this surreal experience when he said, I wanted the movie to be like Dylan's music, complex and innovative, but entertaining, moving, fun. On the other hand, you might come to a realization about halfway through that as a representation of Dylan's music, it is surrealistic, multi-layered, and has the appearance of deep, serious meaning, but in reality is quite shallow. The film is sometimes presented in documentary style, but other times we see dramatizations of the lives of the characters, none of whom is called Bob Dylan. They are called Woody Guthrie, Jack Rollins, Robbie Clark, Arthur Rimbaud, Billy the Kid, and Jude Quinn, although Quinn's real name is Aaron Jacob Edelstein, again a reference to the fact that Dylan himself was born Robert Zimmerman. Also, each life segment is shot in different colors, intensities, and even black and white, which can be annoying because the lives jump around and aren't in chronological sequence according to Dylan's life, but the technique can also help you keep straight which life, story, and character is on screen. In addition to heavy surrealism, there are also surrealistic throwaways, such as a magazine cover that comes to life and a quick shot of Jude Quinn floating up in the air like a balloon. There is also way too much smoking, which can be taken as a statement or a reflection on the 60s in which a lot of the action takes place. Depending on what you think about Dylan and his music, you will either love or hate this film, but the music in it is great. I'm Not There is a love-it-or-hate-it film, even if you know nothing at all about Dylan. I'm Dan Culberson, and this is Hot Shots.